You see, if you mm, if you look at the uh, the the technological changes uh, in the last say um, 20, 30 years, uh, then uh, mostly uh, you know if we uh, we see that uh, innovations are mostly the areas of microprocessors, you know, databases, uh, PCs, uh, and uh, you know, uh, networking uh, areas, where, where uh, the businesses will impact, will um, getting benefited uh, in terms of improved processes because of these new technologies. So technology, uh, uh, innovations, uh, were primarily uh, going towards business process improvement. You know? So, in a way, it was kind of B2B businesses, you know, which were uh, mostly benefited by uh, the technological changes. But now, slowly, in the uh, last, uh, um, say, last two decades, um, we see that this is shifting towards uh, towards the consumer benefit. So, um, you know, you, you see that uh, most of the innovations are improving consumers' lifestyle, consumers' convenience, uh, and um, customer service. Yeah, customer service, uh, you know. So, um, and I think uh, the current, um, um, this thing, you know, the wave of the changes will um, probably you know, this innovation will continue obviously and you know, probably um, more even convenience uh, uh, you know we'll see in, in customer services as well as you know um, as well as you know um, customers participation even in product design uh, that will also uh, improve uh, a lot but also another uh, interesting probably development which may, we may observe that is uh, more focus also on on local environment. I mean, from one side we think they say globalization uh, process, uh, world is becoming a small global village. Uh, 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 you know, everyone is connected to everyone, but. In that context, what also may happen, um, say in a, in a small uh, locality or small place like in Trinidad, uh, we'll see that most of the uh, people, um, the, the business owners, the, the citizens, and they'll be connected uh, to each and every one, uh, also the the materials, uh, the the wearables, everything, you know, so everything is going to be connected with each other. So uh, now, what will happen that a person who is um, um, uh, who is looking say for a product in a in a particular locality, uh, now. Um, that person's demand would be noticed by by different, um, a, a, you know, maybe you know, business um, organizers and business owners, entrepreneurs, and and would try to uh, preempt um, that kind of a demand from that locality and coming up with various. Uh, solutions for that person in that area, you know, because of their um, extensive connection with each other in the locality, their ability to immediately respond to that. So, um, so what we'll see that um, together with a globally connected network, also the importance of also the local connections uh, and the local connections would go up. So you will see that. Uh, some temporary variation in local demands would be responded to very fast, oh, okay. you know, uh, uh, because people would 
come to know very first about the fluctuation in demand or about the new demands from a locality because they connected with each other with with the different kind of uh, you know um, uh, technologies you know um, the, the different kind of uh, you know wearables and everything you know or, or smart materials you know so so in that sense it is uh, it is a combination of both extensive globalization together with localization. You know? Mm, all right. you know? so, yeah, look, this is a unique loop. Yeah, this is, this is a unique loop. So incredible. It's, yeah, incredible. This, really. is, this is incredible. Yeah, it is it's, it's not only globalization because see, yeah, see this this connectivity, this kind of, this is part of the also the, the, the global business. Uh, you know, processes, the technological improvement, how, you know, um, your uh, your various internet technologies are connected to different global networks, everything. So, so that's the global part of it. But also, it's getting combined with the local part of it, where um, a, a local entrepreneur, because of his or her extensive um, um, connectivity um, and network in that locality also would be able to actually notice and uh, a, a, the changes in local demand and respond to it much faster and also come up with different offers you know and how uh, they uh, I mean they will be able to uh, uh, do it there could be probably, probably various options you will see even big data will play uh, a, a, you know uh, and a substantial role in that so um, uh, I think uh, what in the coming years we will see that millions and millions uh, uh, of uh, devices um, uh, and, uh, and technologies are connecting consumers, um, suppliers and individuals with each other and that kind of connectivity will create opportunities for a very wide variety of uh, businesses most of which would be highly creative hmm. because because uh, you after knowing uh, the demand or after knowing the problems of the of the local customers a, an entrepreneur would be able to come up with Unique, probably creative solutions. So it will. Uh, so uh, what an uh, entrepreneur will be able to do um, as a result of uh, local connections combined with global connectivity, uh, you know, would be able to provide a wide variety of solutions to a customer's problem. So customers will have plenty of solutions. To, uh, to select for solving one problem. You know? So that, that would be that. 